And uh, this is where I go, wow. So many disconnections. Okay. So, back to this. As we go through the back hell and just open up the random back. Looks like we got everything. So the one thing I do want to do real quick is open any of those. Let's see. Those. Yeah, these things here. Okay. Okay. I think those are the only two I have. Oh, no, I have one here. Now, the funny thing is, these are actually from, I was playing the World Championships, and I was doing side events, and that's where these are from, so, that is, that is where you go, now, I also have a deck, but I'm not going to open that, I'm trying to give that away for an event, but it didn't pan out, and then I have another deck here, this is the Luminous Frost deck, oh. and then this is the uh, bright tide deck, and then I just realized I have this, so I'm gonna open this up real quick. Okay, it's Fermosa. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> it's giving me a little. How many of these are there? Holy crap! Awake and just. There we go. Okay, cool. All right, on to the deck building. So, as a recap, uh, here is what we got to work with. And, um, yeah. So, I, I guess we're not allowed to use full art cards. Not that I have very many. But it, it's a... Uh, I don't know. I, I guess we'll figure it out. So, again, uh, YouTube, Twitch, Mixer, and uh, Discord, and you can uh, put your two cents in, as it were. As I uh, keep looking up to the other monitor. Okay. Alrighty. So, we're going to create a new deck. Um, it's standard. And then I got to figure out what I want to do. Uh, this filter. So, start with basics. Um, you know the types I typically work with. Um, actually, I don't think I need to do this. This is pretty much fine. Um... Uh, and they have an ability that might be useful. I wish I could exclude some things, but yeah, what's gonna do? Okay, so let's hmm. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna narrow my focus for a sec. Oh wow, that really narrowed it down. Um... Can't use him. Okay, I definitely don't want to use anything there, so let's change. Uh, what would be my next? Let's see what Dragon has to offer. 
mean, obviously, I'm going to look at a, the higher form. Oof, two type, though. Hmm. Can't use him. Okay, we'll try something else. Filter. Start grass. Okay, nothing there. As long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, whenever your Pokemon places a a card from your hand, prevent all effects of card of that card done to your bench to water Pokemon. Move two energies from this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon. I have two of them, so in theory, I could just move the energy between them. But he's only 110. I'm a fan of 130 because rare do you see a Pokemon with a better attack than that. Hmm. 120, I, I can see. 130, not so much. Then again, we could use power-ups, so those aren't banned. Eh. Okay, um... Have a, just a full-on Rotom deck. It would be hilarious. If you have nine or more Pokemon two cards in your discard, well, that's fairly unlikely. So we'll scrap that. Uh, I wish I could use you. How many of you do I have? Only one. Wow, we should have had more. Once during your turn, you may look at the top two cards of your deck, put them in any order. Nah. Something that relies on another card. Mm. Your water pole can't be confused. Mm. As long as this Pokemon is your extra Pokemon, your opponent can't play any stadiums. Hmm. Can't use you. Uh, attacks the bench, but again, I want to use the ability. Tool cards have to be in the discard pile. Wishy-washy. Yeah, we we'll just can't use the GX, so can't use full art cards either. No. Okay, let's try another. Huh. I mean, how much could I... Hmm. Basically paralyze. <laughs> it's just a stall deck. It's just paralyze everybody. It's just Different paralyzed Pokemon. Hmm. Uh, see, this is the example of I think 120 is probably the type you're going to get in the most basic attacking. But if you have nine or more Pokemon tool cards in your discard pile, ignore the attack. Of, I was like, if I can get nine tools into my discard pile. I could basically just slam the heck out of whoever go after, but to get nine tools into my discard pile would require a, a number of turns of effort. I, I cannot see a quick way of doing it. Okay, um... Never know. Giratina, 130. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is in your discard pile, you may put it onto your bench. If you do, put a damage counter on two of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Huh. I wish I had more than just one of him. Oh, I do. Oof. And he's 130. But the four damage counters on one of your own Pokemon. That, that, uh... But if you put it on your own Giratina... And then you just bring them back. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is in your discard pile, you may put it back into your... 
Oh, that is so awesome. It's too bad it doesn't negate price taking. I kind of like this. I'm going to put it into the maybe here. So we'll throw you and you in there. I just, I, that did is, that is spectacular. That is cool looking though. Might be going psychic. It's unusual for me to do so, but it's too bad it doesn't stop the uh, my attacks. That would that would be freaking sweet. Oh, definitely a God. I like what I'm looking at here. Okay, you know what? He's definitely a maybe. I'm gonna put him in there. Nah. Your opponent's Pokemon that have any damage counters on them and any cards attached to those Pokemon can't be put in your opponent's hand. I'm not quite sure why they would be. Uh, when you place Pokemon from your hand to your bench, you may switch one of your face down price cards at the top of your deck. Ugh, no. Max HP of your Lunatone is 130. Oh, well. Mm. Wait, what? Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is your active and there are 66 more da What? Uh, I've seen somebody try to play this one. Um, yeah. There's some crazy stuff right there. Um... Once during your turn, you flip a coin, you choose head, a random card from your opponent's hand, and reveals a card, blah, blah, blah. Okay, no, no, I don't care. Huh. Because I don't hate this. This, the four damage counter things, I'm like, is there a way to counteract it? And then this one, you put a support card from your just compared on top of your deck. Maybe. Hmm, let's see what else there is. Can't use, okay. The free retreat if it has no energy, however, can do 120 its first turn if you play Janine. I don't know if I like relying on the cards like that. Minior. Huh. So, ability basically allows you to switch for it. Eh, now. It says, as long as this Pokemon's on your bench, your Pissimian's attacks do 30 more damage to your Pokemon's active, or your opponent's active evolution Pokemon. So, they'd have to be evolved to get 70 damage out of him. Uh. I kind of feel like other people are going to be doing the same strategy I am. Once during your turn, you may flip a coin if has put three damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon. But then it effectively ends your turn. Meh. Uh, damage from this Pokemon's attacks isn't affected by weakness or resistance. So I play an Ultra Beast. Does 30 more damage. Meh. Wait, what? Okay. Yeah, it's like the powers of Buzag are GX, but I can't use GXs in this thing. Absol. Let's see, this might. Hmm. It would force their active Pokemon, if it's a basic, to have one more retreat cost. And this one does 30 more damage for each. In your opponent's hand. Hmm. So at least 30. But for some Pokemon like Snorlax, potentially 120. Hmm. But he requires. He's a maybe. I'm going to stick him in there. 
and then we'll figure it out later. Um, no. Oof. Periodically checking the chats. Okay. Um, I have to go check out Brunzong and that one. Hmm. Do I want to do multi type? That's the question. This disability won't work because nobody will have them. Oh wait, that was cool. Okay. Oh. Um. Uh. Nope. This Pokemon takes 20 damage from attacks. If Pokemon opponent has an ability, this deck takes 60 more damage. There's a chance that most people are running with abilities. But again, I, d I don't know if I want to do a third type. Well, here, we'll add them. And then come back to it later. Okay, nothing here. So, fairy type. Whenever you attach a Pokemon tool that has fairy charm in its name from your hand to this Pokemon during your turn, you may leave your opponent's active Pokemon confused. Hmm, technically, I have two of them, but again, yeah, no, it's not. Hold on, let's check it out real quick. Hmm. Okay, um, I'll go back and I wish I could like pick like the specific. Here, let's do this. Um, I want to go back. I don't do that yet. Yet. Oh, poops. Standard. No ability. Bye. I'm looking for something specific. Uh, stack the stream more damage. You type base energy on this opponent. Pokemon. I only have one. Hmm. Could potentially do 90. Actually, I can do as many as I wanted to do, but I'd have to run a three type deck to get it to do 90. Or, you know, four type deck would be 120. I was like, well, I can do rainbow energies. Is that a thing still? Hmm. Fetch, headbutt, one, two, punch. Potentially does 90. Uh, wait, what's that? I feel like it's not giving me the sets I want here. Um, should be... Obviously these guys. Ultra Prism up. Where are we losing? The Ultra Prism disappear. Thought we were already doing that, but whatever. Mm, no, no tag teams. Take a different approach here. Hmm. 
Wait, what? Choose one of your opponents to pass. Use it as an attack. Women just have the necessary. Hmm. Would have to match their attack. And he's only 60, so. This Pokemon does two more damage for each time I counter on this Pokemon. I wish I had multiple of him. I'm going to throw him in there. Not because I think he'd be useful or kind of like, I'm not sure what I'm doing yet. Ten of them, wow. Anybody looking for a Gengar Shikan? Um... Stick with two evolution Pokemon reveal them, put them in your hand. Give your deck. I'm gonna throw them in there because I don't know if I'm gonna do evolutions yet. Search your deck for basic energy and attach it to this Pokemon. Shuffle your deck. Lasting 110. That is a lot of add it but again don't know I love this card okay moving on hmm put three cards from your deck on the bottom of your deck in any order hmm three cards in your deck in any order no no uh, Pokemon from your face down in front of you. Your opponent guesses the type. Reveal that your Pokemon guess right. Now you draw. You draw four. Now I was using. I think it was just Pidgey, and then it's. No, it was maybe it was. Hmm. It's one of that does this really nice trade-off thing. Hmm. an idea and thinking about how to go upon it. Uh, between turns, heal times from a big counter. This Pokemon is a tag team. Nope. 